Dodgers Lowdown Hot Stove Baseball Talk out here in Thousand Oaks, the Easton Hitting Facility, brightly lit place, and I'm here with Petey Montero. We're at your baseball camp. Dude, how you doing, man? I'm doing great. Uh, had a really good turnout so far. We had a little guest surprise come in and talk to the kids, which was great, and you know, we had a lot of fun uh, you know, introducing some new things to some of these youngsters. Had Matt Beatty out here. He coordinated that. These kids... Uh, I heard a lot of oohs and ahs when he walked in. How exciting is it to, uh, you know, put on a camp like this and work with some of these kids for, I mean, one of the kids told me you were working with him since he was seven years old. Yeah, it's uh, really awesome to see the, you know, process and, you know, the length of work that these kids have put in from such a young age to now and watching them grow, not only as baseball players, but as, you know, you know, adults, yeah. you know, young adults and, seeing them from struggling in the classroom, struggling on the baseball field, and then now, you know, they're kind of putting themselves together as a, you know, good package to be able to compete at the high school level, which is always fun to watch, and it always makes, you know, especially for J-Rod and myself, it makes our life a lot easier, and knowing that we're doing something to help, you know, the community out and help kids out. Absolutely. Now, talk about 2019 a little bit. Tulsa Drillers with a fantastic season. Tough way to end the season, but I mean, how proud are you of those guys there in Double A? Oh man, really proud, especially for the fact that again, even in Rancho, we had a whole new team in Tulsa uh, by the end of the season, and yeah. you know it was really amazing to see the depth that we have in the organization and being able to, you know, fill guys as we move. You know, when Gavin was gone, then we had Zach McKinstry. Zach McKinstry left. We had Jeter Downs come in. You know, Omar, Christian Santana, all those guys, you know, young players that you see them develop too over the last two or three years, you know, being in the organization and having those guys in Rancho and then in Tulsa and seeing how much, you know, they've gotten better just with the amount of work that they put in has been, I mean, it's been a real treat for me. And then looking forward to 2020, I, I don't even know if I can ask you this question, and we haven't talked about this <laughs> ahead of time, but... What's your role in the organization going to be this season? Uh, so this year I will be in uh, Arizona uh, for Arizona League, basically. And during extended spring training, I'll be helping kind of man the crew with uh, Chris Gutierrez uh, in the infield and running the infield program together and, you know, basically developing the new young studs that we have now that some of the guys are taken care of and, you know, from the Luxes to Jeter Downs, those guys are still working, but... Now we have another crew that's coming behind them to, you know, don't want to say take their jobs, but they're coming. <laughs> they are definitely coming. There's always a development and production in the Dodgers organization, and uh, it's always a pleasure to watch that. BD, I thank you so much for the time. Thank you for letting me be out here at the camp and uh, continued success uh, for 2020, my friend. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. Man. Awesome.